Okay, so today we have a, what is this? A Topps 2021 Allen and Ginger World Champions. Ginter. Ginter? Close to Ginger. Ginger. Mm -hmm. okay. Ginger was actually part of um, a ship that say, set sail on a shore, from, from the shore to a chartered desert island with Gilligan, the skipper to the millionaire and his wife. You don't know what I'm talking about. It's from the Gilligan's Island. I have no idea what he's talking about. Yeah. Anyway, that's Ginger. Oh, cool. You should watch that. It's really mindless television, but yeah, you know, it's okay to take a break and not watch something serious. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, so I'm Dad. I'm Chase, and welcome to our amazing channel. Yeah, we're just gonna keep opening boxes because it's super fun for us to do this together and and uh, try to fund some fun, fun, try to find find some good cards. Find some good cards, and we always seem to do it when the laundry's going. Yes. You guys may not even hear it, but. Um, <laughs> You know, it's, I, I mean, guess... they might hear it now. Maybe we do a lot of laundry. We oh, yeah. Mic now. We do. We, we, we upgraded our equipment, and by that we mean we got a cord, but... We did. We got a cord to plug in a mic. You guys were really wondering yes. about that. Yes. Yes. So, our, our massive seven subscribers. Yeah. Speaking of subscribers... Mm -hmm. Please just hit that subscribe button. It helps me out a ton to know that you guys actually like this content and want more of it. Yeah, we'll keep buying boxes and opening just so you can see um, what's in them, and then uh, that allows you to decide if you want to go out and buy a box. Again, this is another box from Target. I think they're still for sale on Target. Probably it wasn't a, um, a big victory on my part to grab these. Um, you know, I think these are neat cards. They've got that old-timey look, um, so that's kind of fun. And uh, right off the bat, let me give you those odds. Although we should, we should cut it open and then give them the odds, okay. so it's a little bit easier to read. I'm a, you're the boss. Yes, sir. I'm just trying to help you guys out. It has been cutted. Cutted it and opened. Yes. All right. And now you and just safely put away. Let us know if you like it better with the mic or without. I'm guessing it's hopefully better with the mic, but you might not like it better because yeah. it might be too loud. I don't know. Yeah. Um, I did test it, and it sounded pretty good. Sweet. That doesn't mean that's actually the case. You know, someday we'll do more than just shoot this on the phone. Yeah, someday we might get a actual camera. Really, my favorite part of this is actually opening the cards. And yes. this extra part, yeah, that's Chase's it's job. It's just for you guys. Yeah, super. All right, so I'm going to pull these out. Chase is going to hold this. We're looking for glossy cards. I know that. We're looking for autographs. Seems like. Yep. Um, there's, there's like an autographed... I think the rarest card, correct me if I'm wrong, is a framed mini employee autograph. It's one in 87,994 packs. Odds are we're going to get two. Yes. With these, is it eight packs that we're opening? Uh, I believe so. So, so yes, we get, uh, or we might get eight. Oh my, no. Eight and six. <laughs> There's eight packs and six cards. A base glossary parallel. Glossy parallel. Glossy parallel is one in thirteen thousand. That that can't. A glossy one, parallel. Glossy parallel. Yeah. That's one in thirteen thousand. Yeah. When I read the odds, it seemed to me glossy's good. Uh, base short print glossy is thirteen thousand. One in thirteen thousand. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my! We have to make. We have to check the numbers because there are some no numbered cards. No numbered. They're cards. not numbered. Oh. They just try to trick you in this one. Okay. Evil autograph relic book. That's one in thirty thousand chance. All right, here we go. Starting off with a. Put that there. Sanchez. Uh, I'll. That is a Sanchez right there. Okay. Oh, Willie Stargell. Willie Stargell is really famous here in Portland because he hit he hit a ball out of PGE Park up into the, the Mac building. Um, only one of I think two people to ever do that. What what's the Mac building? It's the it's the gym outside of outside of PGE Park and um, I wonder what the people thought when we're in the gym. Yeah, I'm not sure. But I will tell you that um, that's back when uh, we were part of the the Pittsburgh Pirate organization. We had a triple A ball team, which we do not anymore. Donaldson, here's our first mini, and uh, that is a rookie, and that is not focusing. Oh, there we go. It's a tiny 
shiny card. I don't like my Brandon Marquez. Well, I'm just, just yeah. gonna say. All right, and here's our first <gasps> doggies animal. Oh no. All right, my we've got a problem. My 11 year old thinks that's a dog. <laughs> they look like dogs from where I'm sitting. Yeah, they're I'm sorry. they're funny because they're they're like a monkey, <laughs> right? They're a tamarind. But they look like but they dogs. look like they look like a lion. And it's called a golden lion tamarind. It looks like it. Oh, here you go. What? Kelly. Is that? Oh. I actually don't know. I thought I thought those thingies were like feet. <laughs> so I was confused for a second. Leo Kelly. Having polished up his first Shirley Temple on vacation. So, Leo Kelly. Absolutely no idea. Robles. Victor Robles. Mm -hmm. Christian Yellick, so far off the base. Lewis, you too. It's a tiny card. Got a mini. Cal Ripken. Tell us if any of these cards are good or not. We would love for your input. All right, here's an insert. Let me get it centered. Detroit. Murad. Hmm. It's Miggy, the the T fifty one Murad reimagined. All righty, we'll set that aside. Murray, I have a bunch of his PSA ten cards. Really? No one else seems to care. All right. Well, what is David my dad Wright? I collect? I forgot it. Penny Sewell. My dad's obsessed with Penny Sewell. I have a lot of Penny Sewell cards. Yeah, we should, we should do that short after this. We'll post a short on our Penny Sewell cards. Yogi Berra. So, Chase, you don't know anything about Yogi Berra. This is obviously way before your time, and really my time. He's but the best thing about Yogi Berra, outside yeah. of he has a really cool name, um, are his quotes. And uh, his famous for his quotes mm -hmm. being completely inaccurate. He sounds like he would be from, like, Barney or from... Yeah, from a cartoon. Like, some... Yeah. Yeah. What, what's one of his quotes, then? Well, I, I'll Barney. misquote whatever the quotes are, but we'll look them up later. But basically, Ooh, that... he would say baseball is, is uh, you know, 90% uh, physical and 20% and mental, right? And it just wouldn't add up. Mm -hmm. Well, I can't get that to focus. There we go. Sorry. Helton, former quarterback for Tennessee... Uh, are we back? We're back. Uh, okay. You guys didn't uh, know we were gone, actually. You didn't, but, um... For some reason... Amazing it, phone cut out on us. Yeah, it looks like it just stopped. I looked down and it wasn't recording. So, um, I don't think you missed anything special. If I missed a card, it might have been that bird card, but... Sorry about the... There's or you're seeing, right um, there. this card for the second time. Sarah Spain. I'm not sure. But I know I haven't shown you this one yet. Brickley. Chris Brickley. King of the off season. These are fun. All sorts of varieties that are really outside of. Are these of older baseball. cards or are these twenty twenty one cards? Got a rookie. Yeah. Do Mount you think Castle. These, are these like old cards? No, these are this year. Yeah. Yeah. But then wasn't there something about didn't wasn't there a guy that did all those weird quotes? You said? Yogi, yeah, which we cut that, that was still in the old video. Huh? So they put oh. in older players, so like Carlton Fisk. Oh, they do? Yeah. Hmm. There's just a lot of random things, and then some. there's Bryce Harper. And then I've got to open more packs. Yeah, this is it's just kind of a funky, fun set. And they, they look neat. They, they kind of have this old feel, and then they mix in all these older players. Hmm. Cool. Kind of fun just to have in your collection, you know. Yeah. The, um, of course, what we'd love to see is, um, you know, some autos. That autos. would be nice. An auto would be one nice. auto would be, be nice. An auto or a yeah. patch. I would take a patch. Take what's her? Or I mean, you would take a patch. Yeah. Sadly, if... these aren't mine. Or, yeah, they're all yours. Crying. They on all the end side. up being yours eventually. Yeah. Or your brother's. Mine. Okay. Is it the last of the crinkling that we have to hear? Yeah. Dad, next time you open the pack, you should do it just right in the microphone. 
so they get to experience the loveliness of all that crinkling. If I had to go through and identify any of these cards that were... I think... So this card right here is thicker. Wait, it's number two in a series of 50? What's that? Which one? The sideways card. Is it? It says num two in a series of 50. Oh, okay. Yeah. That might be a good card. It could be. It might be. It could be. All right. I, I can't. I'm not gonna put those little guys on top of that stand. Nope. It wouldn't fit. All right. Unless Barry Larkin. In sleeve. Just the little guy in the sleeve. Schwarber. All right. We're back for the last half of this pack uh -huh. opening or, or box opening. Yep. We keep having some kind of technical difficulties, but all you care about are what do the cards look like? So there you go. Hopefully, hopefully you're not. Schwarber. Larkin. Barry Zito from the uh, Mass Singer claim to fame. What? He was on Mass Singer. He's actually really good. Schwarber again in the same box. And here's a deep sea shiver. <laughs> One out of every eight packs. Isn't that isn't that the best best whale sounds? Just <laughs> those impressive whale sounds. What do you think of these cards, Chase? I mean, what do you think of these compared they look to? Old. Yeah, they're sh they're definitely um, not shiny. Mm -hmm. I mean, I I really want to see a glossy. Yeah. Yeah. Sadly, I don't know if we're gonna get one. Well, we'll see. Hey, down below in the comments, tell us if any of you can make weird animal sounds. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 24 in a series of 50. Sweet. The Giants. The Tigers. Slurp, slurp, slurp. So that's interesting because I wonder who the other, if you got all the teams, and then you have 20 left over and 19 left over. All right, let's get a, let's get a good one here. I need to record the slurping sound so I can just play it. Yes, yes, I do. All right, I, these uh, small ones. I was remember I have to focus on Buzz Bissinger. Buzz Lightyear to the moon. Oh, he's Friday Night Lights guy. Sorry, I had to read that, guys. Oh, jeez, your nan would love this. It's a picture of a tree. Yes, because because we're opening baseball cards. There are trees and animals. It all makes sense Mar now. Is that our second Marquez? The second Bernie that you Banks. see baseball cards, Dad, you think trees, right? Yep. What do you think when you see baseball cards? Just cards in general. All I think about, all I think about is the amount of time and energy and money I spent as a child with baseball cards. And all of the baseball cards that I absolutely ruined from my 1980, 81, 82, 83 cards, whether I stuck them in spokes or um, just bent them or did what, who knows what. But that Honestly, was good. That kept them valuable. Made them all, all rare, didn't it? Yeah. Yep. We need, we need. Oh, good. You need the Canadian Prime Minister. <laughs> yeah, he's. Why? He's here. Why does that go on a card? Edgar. So I don't know how I feel about Edgar being in the Hall of Fame. Why? You know, Let's and not Dale thing. Murphy. Wait, Dale Murphy's not in the Hall Dale of Fame? Dale Murphy's not in the Hall of Fame. I thought he and we was... finish... Why isn't he? With A-Rod. Look at the Innis mm -hmm. Mariners jersey. All right, so that is your box of uh, Allen and Ginter. Do you want to go through the minis real quick? Show them all the minis? Well, I, I did show them all the minis. I mean, we did get a couple, like... I A couple of those were... One in one thirty packs. One in thirty. One in one hundred thirty. One in one hundred thirty. The two mm -hmm. with the black. Yeah. What are those called? Oh wait, um, they're mini base mini black base mini black border maybe. Well, who knows? That was my we'll guess. stuff these away in the collection. We've got a couple rookies, right? Mm -hmm. Um. Mount Castle's having a pretty good year. I don't know much about Marquez. And then, you know, I love seeing the throwbacks to all the old players. But, um, you know, it's not like they're from this year. So 
kind of throws you off. But anyway, um, thank you so that much. Was, for yeah, that, that was yeah, that was such an exciting box opening. I mean, we absolutely found absolutely basically a lot of base, which is great, right? Tons of base. But tons I mean, of that's base. Okay, so that was pretty much a dead box. Yeah, but you know, uh, only a dead because we feel like we didn't get anything special. Mm -hmm. But there's some really cool cards, you know, and for. I think 20 bucks um mm -hmm. yeah we're not we're not getting our money back today but some of these will slot will uh, stock away and, and uh you know they'll be worth at least a couple bucks in the future <laughs> yeah right on i just have fun doing this with you chaser uh, i'm dad i'm chase all right and, and we're signing off